exclusive interview with Eyewitness News. The mother of a man accused of shooting at police outside of Gastonia Mall says she's glad her son is heading to jail. New tonight, she told Eyewitness News reporter Ken Lemon the reason she is now thanking police. Ken? In the next few hours, Jamal Hill will go from a comfortable hospital room to an 8 foot by 12 foot cell here at the Gaston County Jail. And his mother says that may be the best place for him. She wants to thank police for not shooting her son. My son is very lucky today to be alive. Melissa Glass said her son, Jamal Hill, could have been shot by police at East Ridge Mall in a frightening foot chase that led to gunfire. Monday, a man recognized his friend's stolen car at the food court and says he saw Hill get out of it. I was trying to hide where he didn't think I was falling. An officer spotted Hill inside. Hill ran. We're running around the mall. <laughs> By the food court. Police say Hill fired shots at the officer, but the officer didn't fire back. I could just shake his hand and tell him how thankful I am. The chase ended when Hill jumped over this wall but didn't expect a huge drop on the other side. 19 year old had just gotten out of prison 10 days ago. He needs help. Melissa Glass said her son befriended some troubled people, including Daquan Westbrook, Definitely. the man accused of firing shots during a fight at North Lake Mall on Christmas Eve. Police shot and killed him. I just want to thank the city of Gastonia Police Department that they didn't kill my son. She said maybe jail is the best place for her son. He's going to pay for his consequences. Now, he has been to jail before. Currently, he is on probation uh, for assault on an officer in Gaston County and on parole for burglary in Mecklenburg County. Now he faces a whole host of new charges, including attempted murder. Live in Gastonia, I'm Ken Lemon, Channel 9 Eyewitness News. All right, Ken.